What's going on everybody? It's Mason back again with another video. I'm excited to finally be back. I had to take a little break there with wedding season happening and everything getting so busy, but we can take a deep breath now finally and jump into some more YouTube, which I'm excited to share more tips and tricks on kind of everything I've learned over the past year and years before through my time doing wedding videography. And you know what? I'm gonna add some more things into this YouTube channel. Since I do also own a commercial company as well, I'm gonna add in some more commercial projects and kind of behind the scenes on those ones and show you kind of a day in the life. So today I'm excited to jump in and show you something that's kind of helped me throughout the year and been a bit of a game changer when it comes to back-to-back -back weddings. And it's this little doohickey right here. Yeah, this. This is the Jackery Explorer 500. There's not really a lot of turnaround time between weddings um, when you're kind of jumping between, you know, a Saturday, Sunday or Friday, Saturday wedding, or if you're really crazy and you're going Friday, Saturday, Sundays, you wanna make sure that you have kind of the ability to get all your gear charged and you're not stressing the day of or stressing, you know, the night before or whatever it is before a wedding. Um, and this goes for commercial projects too, I guess, because if you're on a job site or something a long day and you need to have gear charged, this is just huge because you really don't wanna ask at a wedding venue or anywhere else if you can go and plug into their power because number one, it looks pretty unprofessional that you didn't have all your stuff charged. They don't understand that your batteries die as quick as they may. And even just leaving your batteries plugged into a wall, it really looks ugly for the couple that they paid all the money to kind of have this venue look beautiful. And then all of a sudden you're looking around and you see a wall full of chargers. I would just avoid that. I think it looks unprofessional on your part. And that's why I went out of my way to buy this and have this with me every day I'm at a wedding. Um, and there has been weddings where I haven't needed to charge anything, but the times that I do, I'm happy that I have it with me. So let's jump into some of the specs on this. So this has a AC outlet that is 110 volts, 500 watt to 1000 watt peak. It has three USB-A ports, two DC ports, and one car port. Basically it has every port you would need for any of your camera gear. And just the design here too, it's super portable and just like super easy to navigate. It's also extremely durable. As you can see on mine, it already has a bunch of bumps and scratches. But obviously on a wedding day, that's gonna be good news because you know, you can just throw it anywhere and you're good to go. Also, just to have this when you are traveling, um, when I'm going between two weddings back to back that are um, a bit further away, you are coming home late and you know the next morning you have to be up really early and you don't really wanna have to stay up late and wait, make sure all your stuff's charging. Um, this is sweet because you can just hook it up in the back of your vehicle for when you travel home and by the time you get home, depending on how far you are, chances are your batteries are gonna be all charged and ready to go. And for me, that's been huge this year, not having to worry or stress or wake up the next morning and realize that my battery wasn't actually charging. Um, this has kind of just changed and taken all that stress away of charging batteries. This is also equipped with a flashlight, which surprisingly has been very, very helpful throughout the year. When your bags are kind of in like that back closet area at a wedding venue, it's super easy to use and navigate and find your gear. So what do you think? Do you think this might be something that works for you on your wedding day? Or are you just going to go with the traditional route of plugging it into the wall and you know, winging it every day. This has definitely changed my daily routine for filming weddings. It's given me a lot more comfort and a lot less stress on a wedding day or traveling in between weddings. Um, and I don't know, it's just kind of a nice thing to have in your kit um, for when you are traveling or when you have quick turnarounds for weddings or events or even commercial projects, whatever you need to charge on the way home or um, kind of in between projects. I think it's really, really, really handy to have. But that's it for today's video. I just wanted to share a little piece of gear that's been helping make my life easier this year. And it's gonna help me next year and the years to come too. I literally love this. It makes my life so much easier uh, and I'll be taking it everywhere I go. Uh, even if I'm just going on a camping trip or somewhere with friends, it's awesome to have. It's a nice little battery pack to have. I'm gonna try and upload a video weekly We'll see. I'm just at the butt end of wedding season here, so I'm hoping to put together some more content for you all to enjoy. And yeah, we'll go from there. Thanks so much.